Hold that arm! He's giving you his arm! Control the arm! Damn. Control that arm! She's not controlling the arm, bro. No chance. Get the collar! Bring him in tight! Bring him in tight! She's just wasting energy, man. She's not bringing him in tight. For those who don't understand what this is, this is a clip from the Marine Week. And if you're wondering why he's slapping her, it says, It was my first time doing combative and I didn't know you got points from hitting. So you get points for doing that. You're allowed to do it. It's an official event with the Marines. Now in the comments, you got a bunch of women that are completely shocked as to what they've just seen. you got people saying, oh, why are you not fighting? If she don't fight back, I think she was trying. And I'd like to see you try as well. It says, this got to be against somebody's rules. No, that's the rules. Ain't no way he would have been slapping me. Keep telling yourself that. Darling. This is not settling with my spirit too well. This is reality. If you're going to train to be in the Marines and protect your country and fight for your country, you're going to come up against men. And the men that you're going to come up against are going to be a lot more ruthless than that. This guy even said he was even pulling some punches. If not, you would have been knocked out. It's true, if he wanted to, he could have destroyed her. If that was a real fighting situation, she would have had no chance. You would let Floyd it's Mayweather, crazy. who is pound for pound the most successful boxer in male history, you would let him in a year's time compete at the same weight against women? Yeah, if there's a weak category... This is nonsense. I'm sorry. It's, it's absolute How garbage. How could you possibly countenance putting Floyd Mayweather, <laughs> the most dangerous boxer, pound for pound, arguably in the history of boxing, into a ring with women born to female bodies. And it is, to it is, this is where the argument becomes utterly ridiculous. Yeah, it's common sense. Even if the woman's a lot heavier than Floyd, she's still not gonna win. He's still gonna destroy in a ring. Here's another Marine video of a woman that says that she could whoop any Marine on base. <laughs> Straight away. That might have been a slip. Whoa. She can't box. She's jumping around like a lunatic. Not a chance. I haven't seen her land one punch, bro. She's just blocking punches with her face. She can take a hit, but... What are you taking? 20 seconds. She's getting knocked down. It takes a lot of balls to step in the ring, so I respect anyone that does it, but maybe that might have knocked a little bit of sense into her. Now, just by looking at that, it's pretty obvious that she couldn't box. So let's look at the best female boxer of all time got up against an amateur. Let's see what happened. Can the best female fighter defeat male fighters? No. Yeah, she's the, the female boxer who is really the best in the world. Nobody wanted to fight Lucia Riker. So Big she, Dana I mean, White. She was sparring with guys. I mean, she was probably the best female boxer ever. And nobody knows who the hell she is. Years ago, media reported that Ronda Rousey could beat Floyd Mayweather in a fight. Nicknamed the Lady Tyson, Lucia Riker is a woman who conquered the world of kickboxing and boxing. She hit so hard that in a sports science show, her punches exceeded the force of a male fighter by 200 pounds. Lucia was undefeated in all her 54 fights with women. In kickboxing, she had 37 fights and 4 world titles. But what happened when she fought against a man? She's gonna lose. Even if she's got a more powerful punch than some male fighters, it doesn't matter. Can she do that repeatedly in the fight? Does she come with the speed of a male fighter? Does she have the chin of a male fighter?
Anakim. So she went on to train with Freddie Roach, she was also Manny Pacquiao's trainer, she became the world champion. You can tell she was a great fighter, I just can't believe that her trainers thought it would be a good idea to put her in the ring of a man. This is why I just think it's ridiculous that they're allowing biological men to fight against women. And if you can't understand that it's a bad idea and you think it's a good one then you need to get some help. 